Ladies and gentlemen, today we gather to honor and celebrate the heartbeat of our nation, the workers. Labor Day is not just another day on the calendar. It is a day to reflect, to appreciate, and to uplift the very people who build our communities, shape our futures, and carry the weight of progress on their shoulders. It is a day to recognize the immeasurable contributions of every individual who toils, who strives, who dreams of a better tomorrow, not just for themselves, but for their families, their communities, and indeed for the world. The story of Labor Day is the story of perseverance, of courage, and of unity. It is the story of men and women who, with calloused hands and powerful spirits, have fought for fairness, dignity, and respect in the workplace. It is the story of those who have dared to stand up, to speak out, and to demand that their voices be heard, that their efforts be acknowledged, that their rights be upheld. Our world as we know it is built upon the sweat and sacrifice of workers. From the skyscrapers that touch the heavens to the roads that connect us, from the technology that drives our lives to the food that nourishes our bodies, every aspect of our daily existence is touched by the hands of laborers. They are the unsung heroes, the quiet warriors who rise before dawn and return home long after the sun has set all in the name of providing for the loved ones and contributing to the greater good. But Labor Day is not just about recognizing the past. It is about inspiring the future. It is a reminder that our work is not yet done. There are still battles to be fought, rights to be secured, and voices to be amplified. We must continue to strive for a world where every worker is treated with dignity, where fair wages are not just an aspiration but a reality where the safety of every workplace is guaranteed and where the contributions of every worker are celebrated. As we honor the labor force today, let us also remember those who are often forgotten, the invisible workers who labor in the shadows, whose work goes unrecognized and unrewarded. Let us remember the farm workers who harvest our food under the scorching sun, the caregivers who tend to our elderly and our children with love and patience the janitors who keep our spaces clean and safe. Their work may be unseen, but it is no less vital, no less deserving of our respect and gratitude. Today, I urge you to carry forward the spirit of Labor Day, not just in your words, but in your actions. Advocate for the rights of workers, support fair labor practices, and most importantly, take a moment to thank the people whose labor enriches your life. Whether it is the barista who makes your coffee the teacher who educates your children, or the construction worker who builds your neighborhood, let them know that their work matters, that their efforts are appreciated, that their contributions are valued. To every worker listening today, know this. You are the foundation upon which our society stands. Your labor is the engine that drives our economy, the force that propels our progress, the heart that keeps our nation beating. You are not just workers, you are builders of dreams, makers of change, and keepers of hope. And for that, we owe you our deepest thanks. Let us stand together, united in our commitment to creating a world where every worker is treated with the respect, dignity, and fairness they deserve. Let us continue the fight for justice, for equality, for a future where the fruits of labor are shared by all. And let us never forget the power of collective action, the strength of solidarity, and the enduring truth that together we can achieve greatness. Happy Labor Day, and may the spirit of this day inspire us all to work toward a brighter, more just, and more equitable future for every worker in every corner of the world. Thank you, and may God bless each and every one of you.